celebrating the spirit of more than 30 schools across northern Clackamas County. This is NCSD News. And welcome to the first ever edition of NCSD News, a new weekly quick hitting social news program designed to give you an inside look at all the excitement taking place around the North Clackamas School District. I'm Curtis Long. And although the school year doesn't officially start for more than two weeks, class is already in session for some of our district's oldest and some of our district's youngest students. Well, let's start with the older kids who are spending some of their last summer afternoons right here at the Clackamas County Fairgrounds. That's where you'll find high schoolers from NCSD's Future Farmers of America program, which is part of the Sabin Schellenberg Technical Career Center open to all district high school students. Today, we're catching them at Sheep Showmanship Day at the fair. In case you weren't aware, North Clackamas FFA students raise animals of all sheeps and sizes at the Land Lab near Clackamas High School. And today was a day not only to show off their strengths of their prized animals, but also what they've learned along the way. It's easy to see why some North Clackamas students won awards in a lamb slide. So right now we are doing sheep showmanship classes. The advanced, the advanced kids are up there. Um, we're all novice showmen. Um, the showmanship classes, you're getting judged as you and not your animal um, and how well you can show your animals. Um, today, it's mostly just showmanship. We've been running around all day. Yesterday, we did the confirmation classes, which is all about animals, not really you. What are they looking for in your animal? It really varies. Showmanship is all about, okay, are you, have you groomed your animal correctly? Are you... Do you look presentable? How you show the Yeah, animal. how you're showing it. It could be like, you can have a misbehaving lamb and it couldn't be you, it could just be the lamb, so they will give you another person's lamb and see how you can show it. And so it doesn't have to be the lamb, it depends on how you show it. Yeah. And it depends on also how long you've taken time to, you know, go through the stages and work with your animal or, you know, just even getting help. Well, how long have you, how long have you had these? Since three months old. Let's make sure we get all of your names. Ace Mercero. And what, what, where do you go to school? Uh, Putnam. At Putnam, what year? I'm a freshman, I'll be a sophomore. Be a sophomore, okay. I'm Isabella Juarez, I go to Nelson High School and I'll be going into my sophomore year. Sophomore at Nelson, okay. I'm Alana Rosenberg and I'm going into uh, 11th grade at Milwaukee High School. At Milwaukee. I'm Rebecca Hunker. I'm going into sophomore year and I go to Clackamas High School. Wow, all four of you from different schools, that's yep. cool. Well, sheep weren't the only animals earning NCSD students' recognition. Many also earned awards for pigs, goats, and chickens. Well, hundreds of the district's youngest students are showing they're far from chicken when it comes to starting kindergarten this year. At every district elementary school this week, five and six-year-olds are actually jumping into kindergarten early as part of the district's kindergarten exploration program. You've been doing some coloring. Have you learned any letters? Yeah. Have you done any writing? Yeah. Kindergarten exploration is led by district teachers and takes place through the last Thursday in August. Finally, as the final weeks of summer wind down, fall winds aren't the only things blowing across our district campuses in late August. You'll also hear coaches whistles now that fall sports have officially kicked off at our four district high schools. That means volleyball, cross country, soccer and football are officially underway and many students just couldn't wait to get back on the court or on the field. I think we're going to have a pretty good season this year. Uh, we got some some talent. We got some young young guys getting better every week. So, you know, we won four games last year. Hopefully we can get three games more than what we did last year. So we're looking to get to the playoffs. That's our, that's our goal. And when the kids are out here working hard, taking care of business, and we'll see against Putnam uh, week one how good we, we are. Those first Friday night varsity football games are right around the corner, but they actually start on a Thursday this year with an interdistrict matchup featuring Milwaukee at Putnam Thursday, September 1st. Nelson hosts Aloha that same night and Clackamas plays at Westview on Friday the 2nd. Well, that'll do it for this inaugural edition of NCSD News. Thanks for joining us from the Clackamas County Fairgrounds. Next week, we'll be back on campus throughout the district to show there are always great things to see wherever you go in NCSD.